Hello guys. Welcome to Modern Web YouTube channel. In today's video you'll learn to create this awesome card hover effect. As you can see there is an image in the center of the screen. Actually, it's not an image, it's a video which is paused. And when we hover over card, the video starts playing and the card content is visible. And you can see I tried to make window effect using box shadows here. So, what you think about this effect? Let me know in the comment. Without wasting more time, let's start the video. As you can see, I am writing basic HTML5 structure and linking both style.css file and app.js file. Now make a div with the class card. And let's style this card element. I am already importing Roboto font from Google. This star symbol is a universal selector. This means each and every element in our page will have these properties. It's a good practice to set margin and padding of each element to zero. By giving width and height to body we can easily use Flexbox. Display Flex allows us to align elements children and by giving justify content center and align items center we can set our card element to center. Give background color and font family to body also. Now let's style card element. Set its width to 300 pixels and height to 600 pixels. For round corners give border radius to 20 pixels and don't forget to give padding of 15 pixels. Give transition of 0.5 seconds so our effect will be smooth. If you are new to my channel, consider subscribing my channel for more awesome web tutorials. And don't forget to like the video. Now create a div with class container. This element will contain our video and card content. Give width and height 10% and for round corners give a border radius 10 pixels. Position relative property make sure if any children of this element have position absolute, it will see this container as its parent. And yes give overflow hidden to hide the overflow. Inside card hover block, give multiple box shadows like this. Inset keyword is used to add in a box shadow. Add same hover effect to container element also. And for the smoothness give transition. Now inside our element create a video element, you can download the video from the description. Make sure you add loop and muted attributes to our video. Give video position to absolute. Set its width and height 100% and use object fit property. Object fit property is used to fit any element inside its parent without breaking its dimensions or proportions. I think it's JS time. Select our card and video element here. After that, add mouse over event to the Inside that event, play the video by calling play method. Now add mouse leave event to card also and inside that, pause the video by calling paused method. Remember you can't play audio or video before user interact with the document as per Google Chrome policy. So, in order to see this effect you first have to click on the page otherwise effect will not work. Our effect is 80% done. Create a div with the class content. 
This will contain a card content. Then make these elements. Set intense width and height to 100%. And give position relative with display flex. Flex direction column will arrange the children in column direction. And use align properties to align elements children. Give gradient background and transition. Give basic font style to title. Now style button element. If you have any doubt, feel free to ask me in comments. Subscribe my channel for more awesome web development tutorials. Now set contents opacity to 1 and margin top to 0 when card being hover. And don't forget to add its default opacity to 0 with margin top 30 pixels. Our effect is ready. Thank you for watching. Did you like this video or not? Let me know in the comment section.